you want to stop and think about why somebody wants that job. Because if you stop and think about it, there's a lot to the work that has to be done. That's why most people don't want to do it. And that's unfortunate, because what I'd like to see happen at the legislative level is I'd like to see each of us take a turn. You know, when I'm through, pass the torch to you. When you're through, pass the torch to you. And we should be grooming people to replace us. We should have a citizen legislature, not <laughs> lifetimers. Here are my views on education. I think, I think the job of parents is to protect their children and to educate their children. And I think that they have the right to choose where they do that. It is the duty of parents to make sure that their children are educated. And that doesn't mean handing them over to anybody, whether it's in a pi- private or public school, and just assuming that the children are going to learn. I think we have a responsibility to know what these children are learning in school or not learning in school. And a vote for principal is never a wasted vote. And so that's one of the things when somebody says to me, if, uh, you know, why vote for Ron Paul or why, why vote for anybody if you don't think that they can win? Well, if you have that attitude, they won't win. If enough people who really thought that the right person is here and they have an opportunity to vote for him and they don't vote for him, they're the ones that, that's letting everybody down. Until we can start having the sovereign individual stand fast and speak up for his rights and say, no, this is not the proper function of government, government will continue to be a government of entitlements instead of a government that's supposed to be protecting our rights. And until people actually get uncomfortable enough or get passionate enough about what's going on in our country, you're not going to see a lot of change. But I really believe in hope, and I believe that hope really is a good thing. And I'll continue to do what I do as long as I believe this is what this, this fight that's in me, this passion that's in me, I like to believe that God put it in there for a reason. I don't know whether I'll win this election or whether I won't, but it is my job to speak the truth, and I can't deny what I know. And as long as there's this passion and this fight in me, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to be speaking the truth, and I'm going to be standing up for it, and I'm going to be fighting for it. If it costs me my health, I'm going to still do what I think is right. And that's all anybody can do.